a Libra. This is your weekly day by day tarot cards reading by M for the week beginning 24th of October 2022. So Monday, nine, uh, pardon me, King of Wands. Tuesday, the High Priestess. Wednesday, the Moon. Thursday, Ten of Wands. Friday, Eight of Swords. Saturday, the Hung Man. And Five of Swords. Sunday, interesting, look at this. The High Priestess, the Moon, the Hung Man. Okay, I'll comment on it just now. The star energy is your influencing energy. So King of Wands on Monday with King of Swords. The High Priestess Tuesday with the Tower. The Moon Wednesday with the Three of Pentacles. Ten of Wands Thursday with the Lovers. Eight of Swords Friday with the Six of Pentacles. The Hung Man with the Knight of Cups. Five of Swords, Sunday with Four of Swords. Okay, Two of Pentacles, the star. Look, you did have idea where you are heading, what you are working for, what you are hoping to achieve next, what you're supposed to create next in your life. And you were very optimistic about it. I mean, you couldn't go for it. It wasn't the right time. I mean, I'm talking influencing energy last week or maybe last month. It doesn't matter. This energy, this energy comes from early on. Um, you couldn't support it financially. Okay, you couldn't go for that dream job, dream career, dream life or something because you didn't have enough money to support it or it was something which you been doing already okay and you just couldn't get rid of it so easy okay you had to stay with that what you do planning and doing a little bit for that future for that new goal which you did put in front of yourself being very busy kind of uncomfortable energy because you were neither here nor there you see what i'm saying something you don't want but is still here something you really want but is not completely there this two of pentacles often is just something like that but okay you handle yourself very well here even though energy as i said uh, is uncomfortable is very nervous luckily it doesn't last long and on monday we do have two kings very mature energies and king of swords is your energy you made decision you've got knowledge you have clarity with this energy you do have clarity that's it now it might be that you do have a clarity about what are you going to create now because this is very creative energy something else you will create you will make in your life and this is dreaming about it this one is already planning already doing things everything's doable with this energy because you do have clarity you do have knowledge you know how and you know you will create it you will make it okay um, it could be that somebody else is out there perhaps Aries maybe Leo maybe Sagittarius on Monday this is very friendly energy and goes very well okay fire energy goes beautifully with this king of swords this is somebody who is helping you but very friendly okay this if it's somebody else okay will be friendly as i said might actually do things for you or you t you people together okay practically you are coming with ideas you've got clarity you've got knowledge and this person is giving you two hands so you people you buddies do things together on monday could very well be something like that. Anyhow, you do have clarity and you can create, you can practically do something which you could only dream about earlier on. Things become very doable for you here. Now we start with these secretive energies, um, the high priestess, the tower, followed by the moon. 
funny energies together, okay? It, it's supposed to bring something very creative, something very positive. On this day, you are all conflicting, you are changing, you don't know which way, what will begin to grow for you from now on. You are not sure about that, okay? Right now, here on Tuesday, but you know, it will be prosperous, it will be successful, it will bring you money, whatever that's on your mind, it will be. That's what you know for sure, exactly how to, you don't know it on this day and it might be slightly chaotic energy mostly within you okay you're not gonna say it you're not gonna talk about that because this energy outer energy the high priestess is very secretive so you're not gonna be saying oh i'm confused i'm changing something i don't want to do it anymore like this i don't want to feel like this anymore absolutely not you're not gonna talk your intimate feelings uh, thoughts changes which you are making with yourself within yourself because of this new creation okay you're not gonna talk about that but changes are there and um, definitely or very creative they will give beautiful results later okay something very positive but uh, on this day it's kind of things which are brewing you know I mean boiling brewing and it will be something later on visible right now you're gonna keep the lid on it okay you're not gonna allow people to hear you to see you to um i don't know to know what is going on within you um and and um particularly look this uh, combination of um the high priestess and the moon on the very next day with the three of pentacles now we are talking some new creation here this is old tower going away this is new one begins to build you see what i'm saying you will begin to build perhaps within one month okay or maybe next new moon or in that sense you see what i'm saying you will need one month period and then you will begin to build something else okay you will feel different you will Will begin to do things which are more suitable for you which you are enjoying and enjoying a lot this what you built already you didn't like anymore it didn't suit you now you are beginning with something else something more enjoyable this is new skill this is different group of people this is a, some something enjoyable definitely this is like your hobby oh you're loving it okay you will begin with this new growth new development within perhaps a month's time or, or time of the new moon could also mean something like that but it's going to begin very soon now ten of wands at the lovers it's it's a massive massive burden will fall off your shoulders okay you're gonna complete something and it means a lot for you okay you've been carrying some sort of burden for a very long time doing some sort of business the tower um, ten of wands something you had to do and for a very long time you build this building for a very long time and it, it, it was a burden you carried it responsibly now on Thursday time to drop this burden time to relieve yourself of some sort of obli obligations some sort of work I don't know whatever that was and to receive rewards always purpose for this ten of wands now you've done it the rewards are following the lover's energy says from now on since you finish this most difficult part okay and you drop this load you bring it to an end oh now things are opening up for you now you can choose okay this beautiful way or this great way you see what I'm saying now you cannot make mistake anymore once you completed this difficult task from this point things are going to be great no mistake with this lover's um, energy there is um, this sort of angelic protection so you cannot make mistake anymore you will be rewarded still though though with eight of um, swords something which is problem something which is your obstruction something which is your obligations you see what i'm saying towards other people you know you didn't have a way out you felt very much enclosed into i don't know these obligations this job this work this something um, and it seems to me six of pentacles on friday says 
this is something which goes in your favor this is changing okay six of pentacles brings change and and change is in your favor okay you will free yourself you know from this point you're not gonna be tied up to these people to this uh, uh, relationship to this uh, employment you see what i'm saying you're not gonna be tied up you're not gonna be obstructed anymore freedom you will receive perhaps some money came okay you got paid uh, and uh, uh, that money will solve the problem okay sometimes problems are solved with the money and this is a substantial amount of money if we are talking money with six of pentacles but we can talk that somebody else is um, helping you here done something for you and will free you uh, could be just a, just a resolution just a situation which is completing and finishing and moving towards something else something which is more suitable for you could be also some sort of negotiations that you conducted okay and you concluded it in your favor again six of pentacles harmonizes the situation brings resolution in your favor lovely this um this friday lovely every day so far <laughs> It seems something you've been struggling with um, is going away, okay? You are changing and this week is just a replacing. One day you've got an idea, great ideas. Next day you will begin to replace it, to implement it. You see what I'm saying? And bit by bit, every day something moves forward a little bit. Some burden, some problem goes away. In that sense, the, the uh, every day it takes some problem away, brings some sort of solution resolution brings movement forward you see what i'm saying lovely week for you libra now look this um energy of the hangman and knight of cups says yes you will celebrate okay you are going towards happier times it will be great it will be all right you'll feel good about yourself this is um, a very piscean energy very emotional very happy one going to celebrate going to have good times happier times easy going life could very well be that you are expecting you are expecting something like that but it's not a day yet it says hang in there okay stay where you were things are fine things are happening for you things are changing for you definitely you are beginning something different something new maybe from next month or later but hang in there it will happen you will celebrate you'll be happy in that sense this saturday look this um five of swords and four of swords this swords energy isn't really um, pleasant it always talks about other people talks about competition talks about um I don't know, unhappy, unhealthy relationship with other people. You were definitely benefiting with something. You've got your right of passage. You've got something which you needed, which you wanted. I mean, you definitely feel that you want it. Fair and square, you deserve these benefits. It belongs to you and you're not going to give it up. You're not going to give it to anybody because you worked for that or you got it somehow, anyhow. Doesn't matter. Others will not get it you have it you want it and you will keep it no matter what other people say what they do how they feel no matter um, look four of swords says you still need some sort of clarity some sort of um healing in a way i don't think it's clarity i think it's healing because this talks about unhealthy relationship with people competition people um taking something from each other somebody being loser another one winning you see what i'm saying and uh, perhaps that sort of relationship still you need to heal maybe somebody took something from you okay and uh, uh, you need to heal um, after that loss or um, you are taking something you are the winner okay you are benefiting with something but you are um, not feeling not feeling good about yourself you are feeling other people and you need to heal that i don't know anyhow unpleasant relationship with other people and you need to heal it you need to go through it now on sunday perhaps a little bit uncomfortable energy for you here on Sunday, but otherwise your week is fantastic. Enjoy it.